The rescue operation for the 12 boys and their football coach trapped inside a cave in Thailand takes a tragic turn. A former Thai Navy diver who had volunteered to take part in the mission has died while placing air tanks inside the cave. His death has cast doubt on the safety of the operation, leading the Navy SEAL commander to suggest the boys may not be able to wait out the monsoon season underground. Previously, we thought the kids we found could live there for a long time. But now everything has changed. We have quite a limited time. Though the team has been receiving basic training in breathing through diving masks, much of the burden for the rescue mission falls on the divers. Most of the boys do not know how to swim, and none of them know how to scuba dive. Many wonder how the boys will be able to safely exit the cave if an experienced Navy diver could not. For expert divers, the journey from the entrance of the cave to the chamber where the team is hiding spans four kilometers and takes around 11 hours round trip. Thai authorities have been reluctant to allow the children to dive out of the cave, but conditions are worsening. Efforts to pump out water have not been successful, and the presence of Navy SEALs inside the cave has decreased the oxygen level from 21 to 15 percent. An increased rainfall on Friday has led to further flooding, which means the boys could be trapped for another four months.